Here in the United States, almost 3,000 babies are born with an oral deformity called a cleft palate. In today's HealthCast Local 10 Medical Specialist, Christy Kruger looks at the complications it can cause and what doctors are doing about it. It was on his first visit to the pediatrician that Diana Salazar learned her son Daniel had a cleft palate. It's hard at first because you don't know what's going to happen with them. You don't know what they're going to go through. Dr. Eric Stilnicki with Broward Health Coral Springs says when most people hear cleft palate, they think of the external defect, a cleft lip. Most patients who have cleft palate actually don't have a cleft lip involved. It's just the hole in the roof of their mouth. But that hole can create a host of problems. Because if you have a giant hole in the roof of your mouth, it interferes with two main things. It interferes with your ability to swallow properly because every time you put something in your mouth, it goes out of your nose. For babies, that's really important because it also interferes with your ability to suck. The defect can also cause speech problems. So kids with a hole in their, in their mouth will, will have a hypernasal sound where they will sound more like, when they say the word puppy, it'll sound like honey. When they say seashell, it sounds like hee-hell because air is coming through their nose in a, at a time that they shouldn't. The procedure to correct the problem involves realigning the muscle that runs right along the roof of the mouth and then surgically closing up the hole. Diana was glad Daniel's cleft palate was corrected early before he started to speak. My dad had the same problem and he went through a lot when he started to talk. So I don't want him to go through the same things that he went through already. And we should tell you that kids with cleft palates are also at a higher risk for ear infections because their ears can't drain fluid properly and that in turn can affect their hearing, of course. So for the best possible results, surgery to correct a cleft palate should be done before the age of five. With your HealthCast today, I'm Christy Krueger.